morning, Donald Trump, speaking at Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, stated that he will sue all of the women who have come forward publicly to accuse him of inappropriate sexual contact with them. If Mr. Trump thought that such bullying tactics would silence his accusers and prevent other women from coming forward, he will be sorely disappointed. Women will not be intimidated into silence by Donald Trump. If he sues them, we are confident that an army of lawyers will step forward to represent them, and we believe that the public will financially support their legal defense. Further, if he files a lawsuit against them for defamation, he will have to prove that their allegations are not true. In addition, any accuser who is sued will have a right to file a cross-complaint, that's a lawsuit, against Mr. Trump for defamation because he has called them liars and has said that their allegations are fiction. Be careful what you wish for, Mr. Trump. If you sue the accusers, the lawyers who represent these women will have the opportunity to depose you. In plain English, you will be required to testify under oath, and the women's lawyers will welcome the opportunity to question you under oath. You may find that the questions may include all of the women with whom you have had sexual interaction. In addition, you can expect that many women who have not yet come forward publicly may decide to do so. Also, many members of the public have already contacted me about contributing to the accuser's legal defense, and we believe that the public will support the defense of the accusers. Mr. Trump, this morning you spoke at Gettysburg, where many brave patriots fought and died. You have dishonored their sacrifice by threatening wives, mothers, and daughters who have made accusations against you. These women may not have your wealth, or your power, or your fame, but they have demonstrated enormous courage, and I believe that the public will support them. Your latest threat is an admission of the hopelessness of your cause. It is nothing more than a transparent promise of revenge. It is a new low, even for you. Mr. Trump, your threat is below the dignity of the office that you are seeking. And I say to the women of this great country, we shall overcome.